Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to what should be the finale of my Let's Play of The Amazing Spider-Man for the PlayStation 3. It is just about time for Spidey vs. Lizard. Peter Parker vs. Dr. Connors. Let's do it. What was that? <laughs> what was that? It was just a black screen with Spider-Man falling. <laughs> wow, dude. That was funny. The way he was falling. <laughs> Gotta sift through this scrap heap to find a serum. Don't try and stop me from turning you back. Any last words from the lizard before I get my friend back? Words, Connors, with syllables. The toughest fights are always with the ones closest to you. I know you're in there, Doc. I need you to stop. I'm not sure how much more either one of us can take. Ow. Take it easy there, Doc. Gotta regain some health here. Keep on running in circles, Doc. I'm just gonna keep on swinging. Just gonna swing it off. Stay there, lizard. All right, here we go. Got it. Where are you going, Doc? Come on, Connors. Too old for hide and seek. Okay, hey buddy, if you're trying to scare me, it's working. It's time to fulfill my promise, my friend. Hold still. I know what's coming, but I sure don't like it. Hold on, Doc. I'm coming for you. I need to get 
get out of here. Spiders and water don't mix. What was that? I just heard something. He's coming. He's coming. Okay. Thanks for the lift. Take your medicine. Take your medicine like a good boy. Come on, it's just one little needle, that's all. Keep on putting up a fight and you're not gonna get a lollipop. That's it, no lollipop for you. You may not get a lollipop, but maybe I'll give you a bandage with your favorite superhero on it. Come on. You want the bandage, right? You want that nice colorful superhero bandage. Take the needle. Take it. There you go. And good night. He's naked. On, wake up. Are you all right? You, you saved the lizard. I saved you. Is everyone all right? Gwen, she's fine. You didn't hurt anybody. Except me. What about Smythe? And Smythe got hurt him too. In the jail cell downtown. I guess his dream failed. <laughs> he saw the world in black and white. He tried to shape it to his vision. But it's all just shades of grey, isn't it? I guess so. Uh, well, I guess it's time to get back to the asylum. I hear it's movie night. You saved the day, Doc. Today, the lizard was a hero. He's still inside, Peter. Lurking in the shadows. We all have our monsters. Keeping them at bay makes us strong. Smythe couldn't see that. That he who is without sin cast the first stone. You're so much like your father, Peter. Aw, how nice. I thought that went rather well. How about you, fellas? This is Whitney Chang with the aftermath of the virus outbreak that started at Oscorp Towers and spread to the streets of the city. Come on, Whitney. Spider-Man saves the world. You can do it. Not gonna happen. Spider-Man, once believed to be the cause of the outbreak, is now being called a hero by city officials and the public. <laughs> yes. You owe me a dollar. I'll write you a check. We've learned that Spider-Man not only fought the robots and crossed species holding the city under siege, but also helped develop a cure for the outbreak. Hey, what about me, Whitney? What about you? I bet you wind up in a secret underground lair of some other mad scientist by the end of the day. And I'll have to save you. Oh, is that what I am? A damsel in distress? I don't know, but you're definitely distressing me. <laughs> Another cheesy line to go in your collection. Going to such dangerous lengths is to break 
break the infamous Dr. Kirk Connors out at the Belloid Mental Facility in order to develop a cure. I know Connors helped you, but I'm still missing a father. I know. As officials monitor the situation and ensure that the infection is not spread, I'm sorry. I I'm being told that... I'm being told that Dr. Smythe, who was arrested earlier today for his involvement in this crisis, has apparently escaped police custody. A guy in a wheelchair ran away from the police? <sighs> I gotta do something. Tomorrow. Deal with it tomorrow. Tomorrow? He could kill people, Gwen! Have you gone mad, woman? Well, anyway, that does it. For my let's play of The Amazing Spider-Man for the PlayStation 3. You know, it's also it's a pretty okay game, you know. It's a good, solid, um, solid Spider-Man game. Is it as good as Spider-Man 2 for the PlayStation 2? Eh, not so much. Is it as good as Spider-Man Shattered Dimensions? Eh, it does have free roaming, but... Eh, it has its ups and downs. They're both kind of completely different games when you look at it. But yeah, that does it. I know there's a ending cutscene, so let's just get to that and avoid these long credits. Here we go. I can feel my legs again. I'm turning into one of them. They think they save the city. But how can you regain your humanity? When the beast infects your soul, I did the right thing. I had the answer. It's in me, digging my thoughts, my body. Oh, I calm down, buddy. Not live like that. I am in control. In control, I am not one of them. I will never be one of them. This is the And that's how the game ends. He kills himself. You crazy Alistair Smythe, you. So once again, ladies and gentlemen, that does it for my Let's Play of The Amazing Spider-Man on the PlayStation 3. I hope you enjoy this entire Let's Play. And now we just leave with Spidey chilling with Gwen. What a nice way to end. I'm L. Tillman, signing out.